Hello guys, I am Deepak Ashji and this is my ASUS TUF F15. So in the previous video about ASUS TUF F15, many persons have asked me like uh, does ASUS TUF F15 heats a lot? Like that I got many questions in the comment section. So I have been using this laptop for 6 months and I want to share some facts about this laptop in this video. So before starting this video, if you are new to this channel, do subscribe to the channel and also tap the bell notification on so that you will get all the updates from this channel. So without any delay, let's get started. Okay, so this is uh, my ASUS TUF F15 laptop. The storage is uh, 1 TB plus 256 GB SSD. Uh, so this model is not currently available, I guess. Only the 556 GB SSD variant is available right now. Other than that, the graphic card, uh, the processor and the RAM, everything is same. Only the storage difference is available. So if you are planning to buy this laptop, I will give the link in the description below. Do check the Amazon buying link and buy this laptop. It will help our channel a lot. So let's come to this laptop. In question that many are asking in the comment section is that does this laptop heat a lot? Okay. So I have played so many games in this laptop and I must say one thing. Yes, it heats, but only in those games which are triple A titles yeah guys if you are playing any triple A title for more than 45 minutes this laptop tends to heat and the CPU temperature goes like 95 degrees Celsius 97 degrees Celsius like that and guys I am also using a cooler for this laptop but believe me guys if you are a person who plays normal games and all of those new games which are not that much graphically intensive games then this uh, laptop doesn't heat the keyboard area is uh, superb cool while gaming because we have got three mods in this one is the silent mode second one is the performance mode and third one is the turbo mode so if you guys feel like the temperature of the cpu is going above 90 degrees celsius what you have to do is you will have to enable the turbo mode but if you enable the turbo mode the fan speed will be more but your fan temperature will reduce up to 3 to 4 degrees celsius okay so if uh, the temperature goes above 95 degrees celsius while playing any triple a titles uh, like if you are playing gta 5 for continuously uh, for 2 hours 3 hours then uh, the temperature can go above 95 degrees celsius and if you are playing some small games like fortnite and all then the temperature will be maintained under uh, 90 degrees celsius but one thing that i want to tell is if you are playing new games like assassin's creed or battlefield 5 if you are playing for more than one hour the temperature will definitely go about 95 degrees celsius in this laptop okay so that's not a major issue because for the price of 62 or below you won't get a 144 hertz laptop and being a 144 hertz laptop i have nothing to complain about this laptop considering the price segment because as you guys know 144 hertz laptop uh, we can feel the 144 hertz while browsing uh, like when we are scrolling and all we can feel the difference in 144 hertz okay while in 60 hertz you may notice lag while scrolling not only that if you are playing fortnite you can notice this 144 hertz difference if you are playing fortnite uh, in high to it can run in high to ultra settings if you are scrolling the mouse like it's a game that involves scrolling the mouse so if you're scrolling the mouse then what happens is if it's a 60 hertz panel it tends to lag so much but in this laptop it's butter smooth because of the 144 hertz so 144 hertz matters a lot so for the price of 60,000 no one is giving 144 hertz with this specs so that is the intel i5 10th gen processor version i am using no one will get a laptop 144 hertz laptop for this price so if you are planning to buy this laptop what i want to tell is go and buy this laptop because the cpu temperature only increases when playing triple a titles for more than one hour and if you're playing for like 20 to 30 minutes nothing will happen and not only that the performance in this laptop is great guys the performance to the price is absolutely great that is what makes this laptop one of the selling laptops in the 60,000 segment okay 
and the performance for the processor and the graphics card is great the one d issue many are raising is the heating problem but actually heating occurs but only if you are playing a triple a title like a battlefield 5 that's a new game if you are playing battlefield 5 for like one hour the cpu temperature will go above 95 degrees celsius okay and it won't anywhere reach above 100 degrees celsius it will be maintained under 100 degrees celsius but 95 degrees celsius it can go up to that there okay 96 97 98 till there so if uh, that temperature come you guys can on the turbo mode it's not a big issue and if you uh, think uh, your laptop needs little more cooling efficiency then you can use a cooling pad like this this is the cosmic white material cooling pad after using this cooling pad we can uh, reduce the temperature two more degrees celsius okay so while if i was gaming like 95 degrees celsius for battlefield 5 for two hours then if i use this it will reduce for at least one to two degrees celsius so if i speak overall this laptop is a very good laptop because we are getting a full size keyboard and not only that the display is the major selling point of this laptop additionally they are also giving a performance uh, mod cooling fan mod that's great i personally use it in the performance mode and uh, this laptop is a beast for the price i will say okay and the mouse also you guys can feel in 144 hertz it's superb smooth okay so should you buy this laptop because many may be saying like this laptop is heating so much so much like that so in my previous video many were asking like does this laptop heats a lot so what i want to tell is like no need to worry about the heating because uh, for normal gaming it is not at all a problem and if you are a hardcore gaming you if you play for three or four hours continuously then use a cooling pad okay you won't notice that much uh, heat also guys i am using this laptop in a non ac room if you are having an ac room then the temperature won't go like 95 degrees celsius uh, again three or four degrees celsius will be lowered by the ac temperature so this is a very good laptop guys go and buy this laptop i'll give the link uh, amazon link in the description below so that you guys can buy also if you guys are planning to buy it in uh, the diwali sale also you guys can use my link yeah when the sale starts you guys can use the link and buy it so that you guys can grab the same product at a faster rate so that's it guys i hope you guys like this video if you guys like this video please give me a like and also subscribe to your channel if you're new to this channel hope we can see in our next video bye guys